After their brutal defeat at the Talons of the Kurupeko, Raimante bid farewell to his teammates and returned to Murga Village to train. The people of the village were in need of his services, however. The bear-like Azeros had returned to the deserted island, but this time, the villagers wanted captured alive so they can study the honey-loving beast. Capturing a monster alive can be a difficult task. Fortunately, even in such a remote area, our rookie hunter was able to get a Wi-Fi signal and learn all about capturing monsters alive from the internet. So Raimante was feeling confident. It begins like most hunts do. Damage the creature whilst taking as much care as possible to avoid its attacks and stay alive. Our rookie hunter prepared for this quest with a few upgrades. He was finally able to upgrade his longsword's damage and sharpness, as well as craft the Jaggy armor set for added protection and damage bonuses. After a fierce battle, the Azeros is now limping. This is the sign that the beast is ready to be captured. Patience is required, however, to ensure that the valuable traps our hunter in training has are not wasted. He waits for the Azeros to move to a new location before attempting capture. Now Raimante must follow the beast and carefully set his trap before the Azeros has a chance to recover. Once the bear-like creature has sprung the trap, our hunter must pelt it with tranquilizer bombs before it can escape to ensure a successful capture. Despite the rookie hunter trying to use paintballs to put the monster to sleep, he is successful in capturing it alive, teaching him that sometimes this is the better method of hunting, as it can grant him slightly different and sometimes better rewards. The next step of Raimante's training is rather odd. A young Moga village boy claims he saw some kind of pixie in the Moga woods and wants a monster hunter to go investigate. Despite his skepticism, our hunter in training volunteers for the task and sets out into the woods. As soon as this odd quest begins, Raimante sees an odd marking on his map. Perhaps 
there was more to the boy's tale than he initially thought. Upon arriving at the marked spot, our young hunter finds not a pixie, but a member of the Shakalaka tribe. The small creature is in dire need of help defending against larger, more ferocious creatures. Raimante feels compelled to come to the young Shakalaka's aid, and leaps into the fray. The rookie hunter deals with the stray Jagia quite handily, but before he can approach the Shakalaka, it flees to another area of the island. This process repeats many times until eventually the Shakalaka gathers the courage to speak to the hunter that saved him. The Shakalaka reveals its name to be Chacha and tells us of a rite of passage it was undergoing to acquire a new mask. Afterwards, he volunteers to go on future hunts with us. This proves to be more useful than anyone could have anticipated, as Cha-Cha can make use of ancient tribal dances to somehow improve our young hunter's strength in battle. Raimante will need such strength as the time has already come for his rematch against the fiery Kurupeko. Let us watch this hunt now and see how our hunter in training fares. Definitely gonna need the paintball for this one because it might run away. I know the grind's part of the game, Psycho, but I'd rather only do it if I feel I absolutely have to. I feel like I'd rather try first and then if it goes tits up, then I do the grind. I mean, we may have failed in that multiplayer expedition last time, but it was fun, even though we failed. Bye-bye, Fairy Aqua. Hopefully we'll see you again soon. Ah, I'll just kill one of these on the way. Thanks for your quote. No idea where the Kuropeko is going to be, but I assume I'll probably get some kind of cutscene because this is single player when I find him. Screw the cats.
Nope, not here. Okay, maybe it's in really one of the really hot areas, which means I'll need to drink a cool drink once I get there. Okay, well, I've been almost everywhere. I think apart from the hot areas, I haven't been to area 6 or 5. Ah, here we go. Oh, the fun begins. Fly away? It... It flew away. God damn it. Oh no wait, I'm just gonna go by the way I came. I don't really feel like fighting a great Jaggy right now. There it is. And it knocked me into a completely different area. Come on, put out the fire, put out the fire! Okay, that really hurt. And I got interrupted. Oh shit, the Great Shaggy is here. Oh god, everything's fighting me now. This is not going well. <laughs> oh god, I rolled right into that. It 
set that fire again. Oh, is it leaving? I think it's leaving. It's leaving. It's gone to area six. Let's heal. God damn it! Why that thing keep running me over? Go away! You guy, Jaggy, can go away too. Oh, now it's in area 7. I can get there through area 6, right? Fighting the Great Jagged? Oh no, he's fighting Cha Cha. Oh, did it fly away again? That did. Okay. Oh man, I forgot about the dung bombs. Go away.
that would work. Uh, I think it did. Finally landed a hit. Oh, the great dragon came back. Oh no, no, it's sleeping. Okay. Oh shit! I shouldn't have tried to attack there. Going back to area seven, looks things. Oh, something broke. There we go. myself. Oh, and the great jack is back, of course. And the cat's back. things. Excellent. Oh dear. Okay.
flying away again? Oh, shit. Uh, the paint bomb wore off. I don't know which way it went. Ah. I have no idea where it went. I couldn't look up in time. Actually, no, hang, hang on, let's try... I'll head back to four, check three. This way, okay. No, I'm not here either. Where the hell did he go? I couldn't see a shadow at all. I mean, sure, I saw it when he flew up, but I didn't see what direction it went. What the? No, oh, no, I'm not bothering with you. If he's hurt, he's in seven. Okay, I can get that through. Get there through two. Psycho, you have to remember, there's like a 15 to 30 second delay from Twitch. So it will be a while before I can follow any advice you try and give me. Please bear that in mind and try not to get too frustrated watching. I totally missed that. I might have done wrong, so I can't make the great Jaggy all the way anymore. this guy ok 
Okay, yeah, Cha Cha, keep him busy. Ow! Oh, that's all the carves. Alright. Well, that was a tough hunt, but a rewarding one. I, I can really see why we struggled with the multiplayer variant, because that, that would have probably been a lot stronger than that one. A hard-fought battle with many mistakes eventually results in victory for Raimante. The question is, can this victory be repeated with Jtegius Maximus? Find out next time in... Monster, Monster Hunter! Hunter!